moving south from the main entrance. Okay, on my way. I've got ammo. Give you a hand there. Mortimer's 
precisely a grenade. Clear! Nice! We're clear! Oh, Max, save the day again! Please hold your applause! They're still riding a goddamn door down a river of lava, thanks to you. Correction! Riding a goddamn door down a river of lava, alive! Thanks to me! Do it! We got a scion!
dead, or we would have died for nothing. That wasn't the mission. That's your decision. Uh, well, I think we can all agree the mission was a failure. Not if we uncovered new data. Anything? The drones, Juvies, roasted them. Heavier swarm. We didn't have the punch we needed. You got anything stronger? Mm. Something that can sink the entire island, maybe. Or how about a few canisters of that nightmare acid that killed all them bastards on the beach, eh? Damn. You might be onto something. I was joking. Even if that could work, there's a problem. We don't know what's responsible for the attack or where to find it. Why, Leahy? My grand used to tell me stories about her people. How the young men and women would travel the ocean to face a god. It was their rite of passage. If anyone knows something about what we saw on the beach, it's my grandmother's people. Well, go then. Make contact. See what you can learn. Hannah, you prep for field work. I want you there to ask the right questions. I'm on it. Let's go, Scorpio. already. All right. Let's see what we can learn from the locals. What's the plan with the toxin, Hannah? If we obtain some of that nightmare acid from whatever attacked the swarm on Pahanu, we can combine it with the toxin I was sent from New Hope. Hopefully someone here can fill in on what exactly that acid is and how to get it. We still have to find a better way to the heart of the hive. Yep. I'm working on a solution for that, too. This door, Scorpio. Give me a hand. Huh. Oh. huh. Peaceful. Never thought I'd see where my family came from. Even with all the stories and memories she shared. Brad never told me why she left. Any of your family still live here? Distant relatives, I'm sure. Guess I should introduce myself. Feels like an odd way to reconnect, you know? Marching in, middle of the night. Oh, I'm sure we'll be given a warm welcome. Not every day a band of armed soldiers wanders into town. Well, hopefully they'll be understanding given our rather dire circumstances. Music? Sounds like quite a party. Everyone must be gathered in that hall over there. Couldn't think of a better way to make our entrance. Come on, then. Ugh. Hey, you can't just walk in. Just trying to find the quickest way to the hall. So, Hannah, didn't mean to ask. You any relation to the coal trade? Right. Because every coal is related to Augusta. Sorry. Was just curious, is all. <laughs> Getting a sense you hear that question more than you'd like to. No, it's okay. I like my dad. I mean, yes. He's my dad. Just please, please don't ask me about Thrash Ball. I find it tedious. Augustus Cole. You know I saw him play. But that ain't what I remember him for. Man to legend. The true definition of the cog frontline hero. Yeah, you aren't wrong, Keegan. That's what everyone sees in my father. I wanted to be just like him. A lot of people find it hard to believe, but at home, the coal train, he's a quiet man. Awful either. His introspection about the war kept me far from the military. I just wanted more. That's what I fought for, baby. Dad said. 
One Saren with an education could do more to turn the tide of war than a single grunt with a gun ever could. You mentioned your degrees back when we first met. That's, uh, that's a lot to know for a kid. <laughs> yeah. Mom was always buying me books. Books for my birthday, books for special holidays. Had books out my ass. Interesting. No, I loved it. I think it was a distraction to keep me away from what my dad was interested in. War? Sports. And I still don't want to talk about thrash ball. How'd you meet Hoffman? Through Dad. Hoffman had the idea for this special project after what happened at New Hope. He got his hands on the New Hope toxin, but he needed a specialist to do anything with it. And so, here I am, working on a plan to save the world. You know, Hoffman's been working on this plan for a long time. But when I first got here, he mostly rolled around in his wheelchair yelling at the window. He really... Let's hope there's someone in here willing to help. Well, that all depends on how long their party's been going on. Well, I hate parties. Little help here? <gasps> <sighs> yeah. Oh no! Everyone's... gone. Goddammit. Looks like this ain't a diplomatic mission anymore. Someone turn off that damn radio? Hey, Lonnie. Take a look at this. All this imagery around a creature of some kind. Can you read the language? It's been a long time since Gran taught me why Lehan. But I can try. This scroll references the Awakening. It's the rite of passage she talked about. Listen. The mantle. A terror stalks and desires to consume. Let it be your burden, but let it not feed. The journey. Our ancestors carry you across the world. Their spirits guide and watch over you. Spirit walk. Enter the Fade and journey amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. The fear. Awaken. Reborn, renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden, transformed, light as the feather. Face the creature. Ha! Huh. Looks like a big fucking bird. A bird? Feathers. Huh? Gran would tell me stories about the Wakatu. A flying demon that all children must face as a rite of passage. Are you suggesting that thing at the beach? Yes, the Wakatu isn't mythology. It's real. That's it. We track this Wakatu down and get a sample of its poison. Hey, after we figure out what's going on here. We'll find the villagers. Come on, Scorpio. Let's head into the village. This way. Fight all this sneaking around! 
Right with you, brother! No bodies. No sign of the villagers. Where'd they go? They have more use for us alive. 
Lose any pods here, though. They take them somewhere. A defensible structure. That temple up on the ridge. We can still save them. Let's go. You doing okay, Hannah? <sighs> yeah, yeah. I'm good. We've got your back. That's right. Thanks, guys. I just hope we're not too late. Let's go. Ready to strike! There are stories of people who survived being snatched and pot. But we need to be prepared for the reality that those chances are often slim. I'm not giving up on them. Let's get to the temple. Just through this door. We've still got time to save them. Look, in the tree. We collected feathers from the Wakatu and brought them here. No pods, though. No bodies. <laughs> Some kind of psychological effect. It makes you hear stuff, right? Stuff you'd rather not think about. Yeah. Yeah. But this incense, it's negating the toxic effects. We saw the same incense in the ritual room, back on Pahanu when we first landed. This proves that we can find the Wakatu. Let's secure the village. Then we can go hunting for that Wakatu of yours. Save them. So, what the hell are we going to do about it? Make 
the fuckers pay! Now we're on the same page, sister. Hostile eliminated. power. Mac, this is all you. On it, Keegan. Ammo drop on standby. This is gonna be a goddamn messy slot. Give 
Ground we take back. Definitely feeling the need for a win here. 